not representation I had on the populator. Which is preferably. It's very interesting. It's good. You see this one. Always enter whatever you call a detriment structure. I think the interior of the mosque is just wonderful. It's one of the most beautiful spaces. I think the mosque is a jewel in the way the light plays in it, in the way the, the, the work of the brick, uh, the skillfulness in the brick, but also in the design. This is not only used as a space for prayer, but also for other activities, uh, social, communal activities, with that it can encourage that to happen. It's the most ethnically diverse neighborhood in all of Denmark. You have more than 60 different nationalities living here. It couldn't just be a conventional nice park. It would have to somehow create a feeling of ownership among a very, very diverse group of people. A very plural approach and great sense of humor, which has made it, you know, a, a tourist destination in the city where it was in a in, 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 in the private area of the town. Building the buildings or small scale buildings around the tree or, or adjacent to the existing fabric of the hutong and this is a very exciting uh, way in which these traditional buildings can potentially be densified uh, but also public uh, private buildings that can also have certain public uses to have something small scale to do it more subtly for the old city uh, renewal is an interesting uh, thing for the municipality عرف پروژه ها تو ایران اینه که اول همه با هم خوبن آخرش به خاطر استقاقه که دارن از هم گله دارن ولی این پروژه کاملا برعکس بود ما روز آخر خیلی دوست بودیم با هم برای اینکه اون میدید که حرف ما صادقانه و به نفع خودش بود این در بگینگ این بود اونلی یک بریج که باید 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 but this bridge is very friendly, generous, it's very large. You could, you could develop different uses. You could stay, you could dance, you could eat. It's a fantastic place. If you look at every component, every single building, every single column, every single space, they're very, very simple spaces. But when you pull yourself out and you look at the whole thing, you find a very, very sophisticated juxtaposition of these simple elements. It's a good time to come back to that point where we look at architecture not just as art, but really as responding to the context or to the people for whom we built. I think the building has a message. It, it juxtaposes a modern building, which is as much a part of the international vision of modernism as it is of one Arab woman's fight for self-expression. And it adds a certain flair to the campus, not to mention uh, an edge to its architectural tradition. Well, Zahad was a wonderful um, creative personality with uh, an enormous imagination. 
capacity to, to come up with new ideas and a new way of working for the discipline, but also in each new project. Our selection of six projects is a successful one because we selected six different projects. The main thing which connects them is the architectural quality. It's very much broader uh, than just architecture. Uh, there's an interest in, in political and cultural and social pluralism, which informs uh, uh, a, a lot of the vision. I think the idea that the Islamic world is not separate to the rest of the world. For me, that's the, one of the strongest messages that have come through, and particularly in this time. But I hope that the selection of projects really sees that we are all somehow connected.